Jack, get me my phone. I'm going to do it now. Okay, so let's search for compound interest calculator. And there's a really simple one. This It's called Money Chimp. Okay. Okay, I've got it. All, All right. right. All right, so there's four numbers we need to fill out here. Let's take a look. The first is current principal. That means how much you've got in the bank. I'm going to say $5,000, okay. and I'm going to start when I was 16. Because if I'd saved my money when I was 16 and not spent it was recklessly, mm. I think I could have had that $5,000 when I was 16. Um, annual addition, what does that mean? How much can you invest per year? So for most people, they think about on a monthly basis. They might say... 200 bucks a month, which would be $2,400 annual edition. Okay. So what do you want to say? I'm going to say, can I say $5,000? Yeah. That's, you know, about 400 bucks a month. I think that's reasonable. I often find that with people making uh, median or slightly above median salary, that there are hundreds of dollars a month of money that is unaccounted for, that if properly made intentional, mm -hmm. could be invested. So great, 5000 a year. All right. Obviously, I could have, once I got past a certain age, I could have increased that though. So we're going to talk about that. Okay. Hold on to that idea. Okay. How many years? This was you at 20? This was me at 16. Oh, okay. And how old are you today? 30. Okay. So 14 years. Let's just do it until today and we'll see what happens. Okay. All right. 14 years. And then it says interest rate. So what should we assume for that? Is that 8%? Yeah, 7 to 8. I, I do 7 just to be super conservative. Because I never want to be surprised on the downside. Right. If anything, I'm going to make more. So 7%. All right. Let's calculate it. Okay. What do you see? Damn. What do you see? 